Well said, Commander. The captain will be proud. The captain's not here. I'm in charge now, Joker, and time's wasting. Get this bird in the air. Yes, sir. Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. And we're back with more of the original Mass Effect. This is Hill. We're here now. I think this is the financial district. We've done some shopping. Bought a license. So that when we're out in space, we can get better gear. And we also encountered two more. I think it was two more keepers. We scanned them. And I think we finally found, yes, Helena Blake. Got a moment, Spectre? Hello, Spectre. I have a business proposition for you. I've got plenty to do already. Of course you do. But this would be easy work for you, and I pay extremely well. I'm acquainted with a pair of powerful crime bosses. They're hiding on remote worlds, and I have the coordinates. You could do the galaxy a favor. What crimes did these men commit? They're red sand dealers who make victims of their customers. Ooh, red Those sand. who can no longer pay are sold to Batarians as slaves. They're loathsome, hurting innocent people. They must be ended. I eliminate them, and then you take over and try to eliminate me. How stupid do I look? Hmm. While I appreciate your estimation of my bravado, I have no intention of attempting to murder you. You are the first human Spectre, and you are doing important work for humanity. I have no interest in red sand or slavery. Anyone who does deserves to die. Our needs are aligned. Hmm. And what do you get out of this? We share interests in certain cooperative ventures, but their business practices have forced me to terminate our relationship. Once they are dead, I will manage our organization in a more tasteful manner. If they're as bad as you say they are, they need to be dealt with. Excellent. Here are the coordinates. When these men are dead, I will wait for you at the third set of coordinates. Goodbye, Commander. It's been a pleasure to meet you. Alright. Got some renegade points going here. And I believe, was there a keeper in here? No, I thought there was some room somewhere where there was a keeper. Is there a keeper over here? No. Alright, well, I think we have finished our business here on the Citadel. Let's go and see what Udina has come up with. Most of the uh, side quests are out of the way. I think there are going to be some new ones as we uh, progress through the game. But this is a, a good start. We've leveled up a bit here. Um, I thought I was supposed to come to his office. Hold on here. Speak to the Ambassador. The Ambassador will provide you with a ship and crew. Oh, the Alliance Docking Bay. Okay. Alright, people. Let's go to the Docking Bay.
Yeah, these loading screens are very quick with this game. Okay, so we're going up here. To the docking bay. I almost don't want to leave the Citadel. In other news, Exogenicorp is still denying reports that one of their survey teams has gone missing in the Hades Gamma Cluster. When asked why communication with the survey team was suddenly cut off last week, company officials refused to comment. Strange, no elevator music. Alright, I know there's a keeper up here. Let's go up here and get him. Interesting. Right, Ambassador. I've got big news for you, Shepard. Captain Anderson is stepping down as commanding officer of the Normandy. The ship is yours now. She's quick and quiet, and you know the crew. Perfect ship for a Spectre. Treat her well, Commander. I want the truth. Why are you stepping down, sir? You needed your own ship. A Spectre can't answer to anyone but the Council. And it's time for me to step down. Come clean with me, Captain. You owe me that much. I was in your shoes 20 years ago, Shepard. They were considering me for the Spectres. Why didn't you ever mention this? What was I supposed to say? I could have been a Spectre, but I blew it? I failed, Commander. It's not something I'm proud of. Ask me later and I'll tell you the whole story. For now, all you need to know is, I was sent on a mission with Saren, and he made sure the Council rejected me. I had my shot. It came and went. Now you have a chance to make up for my mistakes. Saren's not going to get away this time. Saren's gone. Don't even try to find him. But we know what he's after. The conduit. He's got us Geth scouring the Traverse looking for clues. We had reports of Geth in the Ferro system shortly before our colony there dropped out of contact. And there have been sightings around Noveria. Find out what Saren was after on Pharos and Noveria. Maybe you can figure out where the conduit is before he does. The Reapers are the real threat. I'm with the Council on this one, Shepard. I'm not sure they even exist. But if they do exist, the conduit's the key to bringing them back. Stop Saren from getting the conduit, and we stop the Reapers from returning. I'll stop him. We have one more lead. Matriarch Benezia, the other voice in that recording, she has a daughter, a scientist, who specializes in the Protheans. We don't know if she's involved, but it might be a good idea to try and find her. See what she knows. Her name's Liara, Dr. Liara Tassoni. We have reports she was exploring an archaeological dig on one of the uncharted worlds in the Artemis Tau Cluster. Oh boy, I gotta decide where I wanna go. Oh, hmm... I don't know if I want to go to Pharos or if I want to get um, Liara first. I'm going to say I'm going to Pharos, but we may go somewhere else. The colonists on Pharos might still be alive. It's your decision, Commander. You're a Spectre now. You don't answer to us. But your actions still reflect on humanity as a whole. You make a mess and I get stuck cleaning it up. I'll take care of Saren. You take care of the political fallout. Not exactly the answer I was looking for, Shepard. Remember, you were a human long before you were a Spectre. I have a meeting to get to. Captain Anderson can answer any questions you might have. Okay, we got some more Renegade. Um, yes, Commander? Captain, can we talk about this, um, Spectre business? 
I want to know the truth about you and Saren. I want to know about the mission you were on together all those years ago. We had intel on a rogue scientist being funded by Batarian interests. He was trying to set up a facility to develop illegal AI technology out in the Verge. Alliance Intel had done all the work, but the Council wanted a Spectre involved. We compromised. I was assigned to help Saren in his investigation. We tracked the scientist to a refining facility on Kamala. He was hidden away somewhere inside, protected by an army of Batarian mercenaries. The plan was simple. Sneak into the plant, capture the scientist, sneak back out. Quick, quiet, and a minimum of bloodshed. I'm guessing things didn't go as planned. Saren and I split up to cover more ground. Then about halfway through the mission, there was a massive explosion in the refinery core. Officially, it was ruled an accident, but I think Saren detonated it on purpose to draw off the enemy guards. He was smart. You needed a diversion. This went way beyond a simple diversion, Commander. The explosion tore the refinery to shreds. The whole place was on fire. Black chemical clouds poured out into the atmosphere. Nobody inside survived. There was a camp for the workers and their families nearby. Between the fires and the toxic fumes, the final death count was over 500. Mm -hmm. Mostly civilians. Saren didn't care. The target was eliminated. Mission accomplished. And I ended up taking the blame. That ended all talk of me joining the Spectres. Saren caused the explosion. How'd he pin it on you? In his report, Saren accused me of blowing his cover. He said it was my fault the guards were ready for us. He claimed that's why it turned into a massacre. Saren's report was all the proof the Council needed to kill my chances of becoming a Spectre. Why'd you let him get away with it? Who do you think the Council was going to listen to? Me? Or their best agent? I had a bad feeling about him right from the start. I should have been more careful. Maybe I could have stopped things before they got out of hand. Don't blame yourself, Captain. I don't. I blame Saren. I think he wanted things to go bad. He was looking for an excuse to blow that refinery. Maybe he just likes the violence. Maybe he was just trying to make me look bad to keep humans out of the Spectres. If so, he pulled it off. The only thing I care about is stopping Saren. You're right, Commander. It's no good living in the past. Uh, let's ask some questions about these places, like Pharos. Any extra intel you can give me on our colony at Pharos? The entire planet used to be one giant Prothean city. Mostly ruins now. But some of the infrastructure is still intact. The colony tried to build on what the Protheans left behind. We lost all contact with them when the Geth attacked. What do you know about the Artemis Tau cluster? Not much. I've never been there myself. A handful of systems with a few small, uncharted worlds, but no real colonies. Might not be easy finding Dr. Tassoni out there. My advice is to look for the world with the Prothean ruins. What can you tell me about Novaria? Novaria's trouble. Always has been. The whole planet's basically a center for corporations to conduct illegal research. Watch your back there, Shepard. Spectres are about the only form of Citadel authority Novaria respects. But they aren't popular. How are you holding up? Honestly, this isn't how I pictured my career coming to an end. Pushing papers really isn't my thing. But you're the one who can stop Saren. I believe in you, Shepard. If that means I have to step aside, so be it. I should go. I'll be here if you need anything. Okay, 84 experience. Anderson's a good man. You know, it's a, a well-kept secret, but he was born in London. Alright, people, let's go. Stand by, shore party. Decontamination in progress. I heard what happened to Captain Anderson. Survives a hundred battles and then gets taken down by backroom politics. Just watch your back, Commander. If things go bad on this mission, you're next on their chopping block. Saren's out there somewhere. And we're gonna find him. Everyone on this ship's behind you, Commander. 100%. Intercom's open. You got anything you want to say to the crew? Now's the time. All right. Here we go. Listen up, Normandy. 
This is your commander speaking. We have our orders. Find Saren before he finds the conduit. And I refuse to let anything get in the way of that mission. The Council wants to ignore this. That's no surprise. They've never helped us in the past. No reason they'd start now. But we don't need their help. We can do this on our own. Wherever Saren goes, we'll follow. Wherever he searches for the conduit, we'll be there. We will hunt him to the very ends of the galaxy and bring him down. Hmm. No, we can't say humanity's in this alone. This is the most important mission any of us have ever been on. The fate of an entire galaxy is at stake. There we we go. will stop Saren, no matter what the cost. Well said, Commander. Captain will be proud. The captain's not here. I'm in charge now, Joker, and time's wasting. Get this bird in the air. Yes, sir. All right, renegade Shepard. Okay, it's time for me to get to the galaxy map. Uh-oh, there's that music. Now we've got the little things here we can examine. 21 more experience points. Alright, galaxy map open. Press A, X to zoom out, A to zoom in, select a particular destination, and whatever. We're zooming out, zooming out again, zooming out yet again. All right, what have we got here? Ooh, so we do have the, um, the DLC was included in here. Or what is it, bringing down the sky? I do want to do that, but not exactly right now. Um, definitely not Novaria at, at such an early stage of the game. I tried that once before and it was not successful. Because <laughs> I tell you, Matriarch Benezia is no joke. Um... Going to Liara's dig site. Here we go. all of these um, planetary descriptions. Whoa, I didn't mean to back out of the map. Uh-oh. That sounds familiar right there. But let's go to Zachros first. There are periodically some things to scan on these planets, so it's best to check them all out. Arcanus? Oh look, we have a survey button. A gas deposit has been surveyed. Scans of this gas giant have detected a large concentration of nitrogen. Final planet. Theron. Let's go. Alright, and it 
wants us to land. This is going to be tough because we are very inexperienced at this time. Um... Who do we want to take with us? Alright, I am going to take Ashley. And I think we're taking Tally. We need somebody that's going to have high electronics. Debut of the Mako. This is the the much Commander, I'm picking up some strange readings. Malign really strange, like off the damn charts. It looks like it's coming from an underground complex a few clicks away from the drop zone. I remember trying to play this with keyboard and mouse, and I tell you, I was not having much luck at all trying to control this thing. And it's even hard to control with a controller. I think somebody made a mod, though, that, that makes it easier to uh, control this. All right, let's stop for a minute and get a scene. And let's also make sure Tally has her electronics up. No, nope, see, look at that, no electronics. Oh boy, she's gonna need decryption too. Nice. All right. So she can't do anything else, and I don't know how she can stay alive either. All right, Tally. Give it your best. But I need your electronics and, and decryption skills. Because if this uh, Mako gets damaged, we need you to repair it. Dropship. Oh, we got experience with it. I don't even know the buttons yet. Okay. save so we don't have to repeat this battle again. Alright, we 
we've lost our forward shields. Hopefully these will regenerate quicker. Uh-oh. Got something red up here on the radar. back entrance. Uh-oh. Still more, though. Now who's shooting at us? Got him. It's not clear, though. All right, we're just gonna park over here. Looks like there's some containers. Two assault rifle, light human armor, gladiator two, and hydra two. All right, I guess we're going in here, looking inside these, um. buildings for something or not all right looks like this one's empty it's clear now why does tally have the most shields out of everybody ashley should she's got the heavy armor So let's override it. 
Alright, shotgun and sniper rifle. I am going to reduce these to metagel. know we could open that gate already. Fires the Mako's cannon. RT fires its machine gun. Use left trigger to zoom in. It's not zooming. Now on the PC controls, it does really zoom in. And it, unfortunately, I never was able to figure out when I played on Xbox 360 how to do that. And I don't think you can. His left trigger does not zoom in. Mm -mm. All right. Head rounds and chemical rounds. We'll take those. Plus a grenade, it looks like. save. Um, let me take some meta gel. Something in here. Barrier up. Sniper Rifle Reaper 2, Light Armor Explorer 1, Light Armor Assassin 2. We'll take it all. So, oops. Something I'm not understanding here. It looks like we could have just ignored those turrets. And just drove off, but I guess we're here trying to get as much experience as we can. Oh! Wait a minute, how are they hitting us way over here? time I can even uh, 
get these my aim Out. What? Oh no. Ashley's down. still up let's have you use sabotage oh no no 